at the fifth executive council meeting in government as Lokoja, Governor Bello, who thanked the members of the executive council for their support and commitment, also expressed appreciation to the people of Kogi State for its re-election and urged them to continue to move the state forward. I couldn't have achieved this success alone. Like I said, God Almighty and good were behind us. He highlighted some of the areas his government had made positive impact in the lives of the people. We must do everything, either in government or outside government. Do everything to unite our state. It's a great attribute. It's a great asset. It's a great achievement. Governor Bello announced the dissolution of the cabinet and the composition of a new one. Those of you that will be going home to rest and meditate over your performance ever since you come on board today you should consider yourselves lucky to have served in this very audacious moment weather the storm and record this great success and at the same time consider yourself as a continuous member of this family even long after our second term by the grace of god members of the old cabinet who kept their jobs include the secretary to the state government ayuade folashade chief of staff to the governor abdul karim asuku head of service deborah ogumala deputy chief of staff sunday faleke and state security advisor jerry omodara Others who retain their cabinet positions are Chief Press Secretary Onogu Muhammad, State Auditor General Yakubu Okala, Local Government Auditor General Usman Odudu, and the State Accountant General Jibri Momo. The new appointees are Ibrahim Muhammad Sani, Special Advisor on Legal Matters, Idris Asiru Asiwaju, Special Advisor Finance, Budget and Economic Planning, David Ape, Special Advisor on Agriculture, Dr. Saka Audu Haruna, Special Advisor on Health, Engineer Abubakar Sadiq O'Hare, Special Advisor on Local Government and Chieftaincy Affairs, and Kingsley Fanwo, Special Advisor on Information and Communication. Governor Bello told the constituted cabinet members to work towards achieving the objectives of the new government. Some of the appointees promised to repay Governor Bello's trust in them by giving maximum service. Profound gratitude to the ex executive governor of the state for the intrinsic confidence he has reposed uh, in me uh, by giving me uh, a new role to be a special advisor on information and communication strategy. Uh, it's, uh, it's a new service uh, to draw a new strategy for communicating and getting the information about government to the people at the grassroots level. And thank the Governor Elijah Ayabelo for the confidence he has in us. And by the grace of God, we will not disappoint him. We are going to strategize to improve on what we have achieved before for the betterment of the good people of um, Kogi State. Governor Bello told the reconstituted cabinet members to work towards achieving the objectives of the new government. Some of the appointees promised to repay Governor Bello's trust in them by giving maximum service. Avoy Umogu, AIT News, Lokoja.